folks, Steve here at Boss Failures. Today we're gonna to take a closer look at a 2023 Venture RV Sport Track model 327 VIK. The 327 VIK is a 36 foot 4 inch overall length and it is just shy of 8,300 pounds. It's a family unit, three slide out. Um, folks, since its introduction, it's been our best selling family unit in the yard, hands down, and I think you'll see why. I don't want to waste too much time, and folks, we're gonna go quick. We're gonna do this video all in one, so exterior and interior, and I don't want this to drag for 20 minutes, so uh, just uh, follow. So, all right, at the front, electric tongue jacks. This is where your propane tanks are. At the back, your battery will be on that little rack. We have a battery disconnect. Uh, stone guard, beautiful front cap, incorporated front windows to it. It brings a lot of light in, a lot of people like that. Very large access to your pass-through storage and heights. Uh, slam latch handles with magnetic holder. There is a motion detector light on the other side. There's also a switch, a switch I will turn it on. Four uh, blue LED ground light. They're actually underneath the trailer just to give you a little bit of a, a mood at night. All right, docking station. Pretty simple. There's your water, outside shower without and cold, cable satellite hookup, and this is to... Uh, the valve that you switch to fill up your fresh water tank. Your black tank flush is right here. Moving along. Double wiper seals on all the slide out. Bomb seals in a track. Uh, rack and pinion system on all of the slide out. There is a rain gutters above the slide out on every single one of them. Actually, there is a rain gutter on the trailer as well with spout extension. And folks, that's including the rear wall. Actually, pretty rare. Uh, moving towards the front, we have a detachable power cord. The kids slide out at the back. They recess the bumper to save on the link. Really liking that. There's a two inch uh, receiver hitch here and it can handle 250 pounds. So if you're towing, you can put the bike rack uh, back here. Your fresh water tank, or I'm sorry, your water heater is right here. It runs on gas and propane. It's ready for a backup camera. Your roof ladder right here. All the exterior lights, all the interior lights, everything is LED now. And then we have our outside kitchen entertainment area or outdoor entertainment area. So yes, folks, you're getting a second TV and a second AM, FM, CD, DVD, Bluetooth, USB, auxiliary, and HDMI right out here. So uh, Saturday morning cartoons for the kids, no problem. Everybody out of the trailer, you can sit at the picnic table and watch the cartoon in here. It comes with a griddle. Your sink with hot and cold water, a little tap, and a fridge. Uh, speakers right here, and there's a little light as well to uh, light up behind the TV. A little bit of storage, just pretty nice outside kitchen. I think most customers, when they, uh, when we open up this compartment, uh, they're like, ooh, wow. <laughs> yeah, so the big slide out on this side, so your big windows right here on the side of your patio, that's kind of nice. You are getting a big handle. A bottle opener dog leash holder. You're getting the new step, very sturdy. A lot of people like them. Uh, self closing screen doors right here. And this year they added the screen defender. So it is metal and it's pet friendly. It's actually for your pets so they're not walking right through the, the screen. Earlier I met, uh, I said less than 8,300 pounds. I apologize, it's actually less than 8,400 pounds. It weighs 8,390 pounds. And our pass-through storage at the front right here. Again, we can see that uh, motion detector LED lights and that switch for the lights underneath the trailer. Inside, let's not waste any time. When you come in, door to the bathroom right in front of the entrance door. It's kind of nice. You don't need to track the dirt all the way to the trailer to get to the bathroom. Now, this comes in two configurations. So let's talk about this right now. This one as the King U Sofa. Look at that folks, it is uh, a lot of customers favorite because it's really a lounge. Uh, you can lounge with the kids actually, so it's pretty nice. But it is an option, if it doesn't come with this, it will come with a traditional dinette and a sofa, a three-fold sofa or theater sitting right here. So the way we have it in our yard right now, as you can see, is with the king sofa. Table is removable, it also converts into a bed. So that's pretty nice. Uh, LED lights uh, on the top. There's a light switch on the roof here. 
all of the blinds on the windows are pleated shades and in our kitchen so uh it's a pretty nice kitchen so you get the kitchen island because they added this slide right here so stove and fridge slides right out it allow enough room to put a, a kitchen island there's a little buffet or whatever you want to call that here lots of storage underneath there's a shelf in there perfect spot for the bagels and the bread perfect spot for the coffee maker and toaster lots of storage above as well and right at the end of this little uh, cabinet here there's a place for uh, charging your phone there's a 12 volt USB outlets and the power outlets and your monitor panel is hidden right here as well as all the switch for um, uh, the slide out so uh, single bowl very deep farmer style sink uh, pretty nice there's drying rack there's also a cutting board a designer cutting board that would fit right here as well there is a nice tap lots of storage below and they always try to leave a spot for a garbage can so there it is folks there's no shelf on that side that's what it's for uh, lots of drawers plywood made ball bearing hardware place for your sponge or knife or spices there's a pots and pan drawers right here there's plenty of storage right beside the stove with a shelf a window range hood vented outside microwave more storage on the top we got a three burner stove, flush mounted, bifold, glass top, oven, all animal finish. The button lights up as you can see. And in this particular trailer, it did came with the 10 cubic foot, 12 volt fridge. Look at that folks. Nobody's gonna fight to get that uh, jar of peanut butter or jam in the fridge here. And look at the deepness of the freezer. 12 volt fridge, doesn't require a chimney in the back. so. On a traditional gas electric fridge, you gotta leave a space behind so it's not as deep. Here they can use the entire depth of the cabinet. There's no vent on the side, there's no vent on the roof. A great fridge, doesn't consume any power. It's ready in like 30 minutes versus a full day for the other way uh, for a gas electric fridge. So this is a great fridge. Now, pantry, there won't be an issue here. Look at the size of that, it's as big as the one at home. And if this wasn't enough, there's a little bit of storage above and below the TV. So space here and space here. Now, 40 inch TV is the same size as the one outside, same stereo as the one outside, uh, but they added a fireplace 30 inch wide, frameless, it's pretty nice. There's also a skylight with a blind in the kitchen living area. The AC is ducted through the roof with closable vents and the furnace is ducted through the floor as well. So uh, let's go to see the kids room. Pretty nice uh, little room here. All right, so top bunk, 250 pounds capacity goes up. We get a sofa that folds flat. Uh, the middle cushions fold down with cup holders. There's a table that comes with this. On this side, top bunk is much wider uh, no problem for a teenager or an adult. Uh, 500 pound capacity. This one here, 250 pounds capacity. Everybody's got lights and, uh, and a USB uh, power uh, connections. There's a spot for a TV if you want right here. There's a window, a little bit of storage below. And some drawers. But there is a huge closet in here with a bar and some extra shelf. So that's a pretty nice kids room. Now at the front is where the parents room is, but on the way we have our bathroom. So a motion detector night light. There's a switch for the light. There's also a switch for the power fan. Comes with a porcelain toilet. There's a nice little vanity here with a stainless steel sink, medicine cabinet, a beautiful corner shower with glass enclosure. And they actually managed to squeeze in a very decent sized linen closet with shelf. And also in this room, well, there's a skylight, there's a power fan. And there's a little gizmo on the, on the wall here. It's called the Level Mate Pro. This is designed to help you level your trailer. It will sync to a, an app that you'll download on your phone. And it will tell you when you are level sideways and front to back. Now, front bedroom is accessible from the bathroom or the hallway. 
It is a pretty nice uh, front bedroom. It's a true queen size, 60 by 80, just like at home. It comes with a designer that spread the sham and pillows. Uh, front window is great. Shirt closet, I really like. They cut the back. Uh, there gives them enough room to put a shelf there. There's a power outlet and a USB outlet on the other side. In the closet, we have real bars. You can hang a real hanger. Really like that. And look at the heights of that. You're not going to wrinkle your pants or your skirts or your dress. Two windows, a roof vent. There's gas struts underneath the bed for easy access to the storage. Also, the bed base is plywood. So as a floor, 5-8 tongue and groove plywood deck. Uh, it's getting to be pretty rare in the industry. Most of the product line out there, they use a laminated construction. Not as good as the plywood, of course. And uh, there's a spot for a TV as well. There's a light switch on the wall for the main light. And there's two lights above the bed. Folks, I think, uh, I know that was quick. I hope you followed. Uh, great trailer. Uh, we do very well. If you're interested in having more information, give us a call. Better. Uh, yeah, just stop and see us. We'll be happy to demonstrate. Folks, I think we've done it. Thanks for watching.